Oh my goodness. This is John Ketchel. And if you think about Ketchel, Ketchum and Kennel. guys we have made it about eight miles across there from where my car is on the other side of the field it is hot I'm in black I'm trying to take refuge underneath this tree <laughs> oh love is that a walk but there is a cemetery in this grove and what is fascinating about the cemetery, if you can look behind me, I mean, this is miles and miles that used to be woods that are now fields. So there was a homestead here somewhere. Um, I might get to do an interview with the elder gentleman that does let us in here. You have to ask his permission. His name is Mr. Schneery. But I'm going to cut this short because... I know you guys will be watching an hour video as it is, so let's make our way in here. The places Nicole gets into. Hello? You welcomed me here before. Find our way through. I see one grave marker. Don't need my bag. It's right here. Hello, I'm Nicole. Remember me? We just come to document and talk. If you would like to talk this time. Now, the way I found this, there they are, the way I found this was uh, my cousin had actually found it hunting, and every time he brought in his equipment, it either broke coming up here or the batteries died before he got here. And I'm sorry to be huffing and puffing, but I'm trying to catch my breath. And I don't mean to be walking on you guys, but it's kind of clustered and crowded in here. There is another stone there. Pardon me. You can wait by the backpack. And I'll... It's probably a lot better in the fall. You can speak into my camera here. You're making my ears go off. I'll talk to you in a second. How are you doing today? Yeah, there's another stone. I'm pretty much on my hands and knees, Becky, so you might want to stay. There's another little stone over there. I know there's a big one back here if it's not already been. Excuse me. I'm on my hands and knees here. Pardon me. Oh, wow. There is a. These old locust trees. If y'all knew anything about locust trees. Ow! They got pointy things on them. 
thing that fell over. I'm gonna try to make my way all the way through there. I'm gonna put my sunglasses on for eye protection. Maybe not, but I really wanted to document this before it was gone. There's another one. Hiding in that branch. There's one there in front of me. I know, I'll talk to you guys here in a minute. I do see a couple people up in that bush. Um, There is a bigger stone here. I've seen it. I hit my nose. It was broken. And they're all pretty much gone. Deer trail through here. bushes and I wish these were readable oh there's the big one I'm gonna see if I can get my way around to it I am walking through all this so, sorry if you have to look at the ground for a moment I'm watching for snakes too Stand up just yet. Okay. Hello? Oh my god, my heart just took two beats. Wait, this got two beats. I don't mean any harm. It was a little deeper than a baby turkey bell deer. Can I come over and take a picture of your tombstone? Do you mind? I would like to record it before it's all gone. All right, I'm going forward even though I got hissed at. See if there's a name. Ooh, hello. How are you? It just went from really, really cold. Oh my God, I wish I had my SB right here. How are you? Are you the one that hissed at me? Oh my God. I just want to take a picture of your tombstone, okay? I don't know if you could see the goosebumps on my eyes. It's, oh my God, Becky, you ought to come in here. It's like, it's like on the hill. Remember the Dybbuk Hill? Um, can I come through? Somebody is following me. Are you moving? Okay. Sorry. Didn't mean to, like, stop it there. Um, somebody is following me. I'm just going to look at your tombstone, and I'll leave out of right here, okay? I know you don't get many visitors. Rambles. And as hot as I am, it is really, really cold. I don't mean to have you guys point me to ground. Okay. This is the 
does have engravings on it. Mariah. Wife of you. Um, I can't see the death date. It was June. I could like run that over whenever I get back home. Mariah, you can speak into my camera here if you want to speak to me. I'm sorry if I'm standing on you. Okay, guys, we're gonna. Hi. I just stood right up against somebody. I know you're behind me. My name's Nicole. Is that you, Mariah? Guys, if you see somebody standing, I'm trying to keep it on me. But as you can see, I am sweating. I know I'm going to feel a little bit of a chill, but it is cold over there. I'm not as cold right here. Okay, I'm, I'm going back out. I said I would. I've got to pretty much duck in and out. I'm trying to find, follow this deer trail. I could, ow, find out where my tech went. Okay, this, this graveyard is backwards. I'm going to see if I can get in there and read. I see a name on this one. I'm literally hunched down in here. Okay, I can stand up for a minute. Got to watch my glasses. Okay. Oh my goodness, this is John Ketchel. And if you think about Ketchum, Ketchum and Killum. Uh, he was born 1847 and no. Seventeen eighty four, and he died in eighteen something. There's an engraving on there. Oh, I should have taken his name out. I should have named out. I, I should have looked up too. Hello. You gotta see the light sparkling on this grave. How are you? Okay, guys, I'm gonna try to get out from underneath here. How many more people I am walking on? Trying to make my way. Oh. Over. A tiny, tiny trail. I would like to go back over where that cold spot is and see if I could talk to somebody with the SB. I can make my way. I made it through there once. Yeah, I'll 
the writing is on this side. I didn't know grapes pointed toward the west. I thought they pointed toward the east. I guess the sunset would... Oh, no. This is I-R-A-S-M-U-S. -S. Brown. 1811. 1841. If I'm wrong, I'm sure one of you guys will let me know. Um, oh my god, what smells of dead? Ooh. This one says 1918, born and died, 1801, as best as I can see there, I'm trying to record these the best I can. I didn't bring that light. This is also a brown, 1852. Okay, he was born in 1816 and died in 1852. This is... E R A S H A S Brown. A lot of these words are old words. I don't even know how to say that. Hello? Can I call your name? I do see a young woman standing just over there where it was cold. Get a quick SC11 because we are still heading to um, the mill. <sighs> okay, I know to walk behind you now. <laughs> I don't want to walk on people. So this place is pretty much how <sighs> history. <laughs> no one's really upkeeping it. Of course, it's out here. There's probably, it took us eight miles to get here, and it's probably, oh, spidey senses. It's probably a good 12 mile circle around the nearest property, and I don't think the farmers are gonna stop way back around over there where it was. Oh, never mind, the coach showed up. This box is not going to hurt you. If you come and speak to it. Can you tell me your name? You want to tell me your name for record? Hello? Huh? 
How are you today? You want to come out and talk to me? Did you live in Oakville? Okay, our temperature is spiking. How are you? I used to live in Oakville. Was your farm close? I can hear him speaking to me. It's really low. Yeah, we just we went up in temperature a little bit. Can you tell me what you used to do? Were you a farmer? Ooh, I had a cold breeze run through me. Were you worried about the Indians? I bet there was a lot of Indians out here. I can see you're really close. Take them out. You want to take that all the way out for me? And we are standing in the stage, so it's not the sun. I'm going to get ready to go to Oak Town. Okay, I'm going to bring out the necro cue for a minute. I wish a tractor would drive up in. What is that jingling like a cat bell? Please tell me y'all hear that. I hear jingling like a cat bell. Oh, I'm poke my eye with one of these locust trees. And I know I'm stepping on people, and I'm sorry. Put that in there.
Oh, you feel that? That hair in my mouth. I will delete it. There. Yeah. Necro for just, just a little bit because then I, I gotta get off this hill. Yeah, I don't want to be walking eight miles in the dark through the middle of a cord and being filled. No. <laughs> Azrael, remember that? We heard that. We, I read that over there a while ago. How are you doing? <laughs> Did you live in Oak Town? <laughs> yes. What did you do there? <laughs> Not sure I caught that. <laughs> Hello, how many people are here? Seven. My name's Nicole. I'm, I'm glad you come and talk to me. Was your house close here? Did you live at the bottom of the hill? <laughs> what other names are here? What's your name so I can record it? Anyone else? Did anybody get sick? Who's over to my left? Is everyone nice out here? No. I think they need to clean your cemetery. What do you think? Oh my god, it scared the crap out of me. I thought somebody touched my leg. Mystique. Okay, guys, I just. I just want to talk to you for a minute. I got a long walk home. I'll let everybody know you're here. Would that be okay with you? Well, I don't know what that was, but that was pretty freaky. Okay, guys, um, I guess we're going to make our way off this hill before it gets dark. 
long walk that I just wanted to stop in. I remember this place whenever I was younger, uh, came in and like I said, his batteries wouldn't work, cameras wouldn't work. And I actually came in here, it was on the other side, and I asked for permission to document them. And I came in here, we took a lot of photos. And of course those photos are gone now, so that's why I wanna document it with recording. So we, we do have that. Got a few names. Um, I'll look over the audio. Hey, I'll be a followed in here. There's something sounded like cat bells. And oh, my psychic senses are going crazy. I can't hardly hear. Um, but yeah, we're gonna make our way out of here. And we are heading to Main Brothers. Um, the Honey Grounds there. And the, uh, the bridge where all the, the crate buggies uh, kind of crashed off there and a massive train wreck that happened at the depot that killed uh, the station master and the railroad engineer. So yeah, we are coming off a hill and what was that? We have gunshots folks, so I'm out of here. Okay guys, see you in Oakville. I'm sure she